got a lot of stuff in here. I might have gotten a real lucky one because people get different ones. Yeah. You don't know. Um, I feel like there's more stuff in here. Hello my friends, welcome to my Beautylish Lucky Bag unboxing. Uh, this is a different video on my channel. This is the third Lucky Bag that I've gotten and every time I film it, it's like impromptu, like there's no planning ahead. Today's Saturday, it's my editing of What's Up and Makeup Day, so I have no makeup on, the kids are home. So I last year I involved the kids in unboxing the Lucky Bag and they really, really liked it, so I brought them back for this video. So if you've never met these guys before, what's your name? John. And what's your name? Lila. And how old are you, John? Five. And how old are you, Lila? Eight. All right, so just to show that I have not opened this, there you go, there's the tape on the bottom, and we're going to open it, and the kids are going to help me pull products out. Hold on, watch your fingers. Okay. This is very exciting. If you don't know what a lucky bag is, before we open it too much, a lucky bag is done every year on December 26th by Beautylish.com. It's a mystery of things that you can buy at Beautylish. So they sell a lot of high-end brands like Charlotte Tilbury and um, uh, what else? Um, Viseart and just all kinds of really nice stuff. Wayne Goss and just lots of good stuff. So I get really excited to do this. If this box was the smaller version. It was $82. The only people that were able to get the X L, the big version, I think it was 150 plus shipping. The only people that were allowed to do that were people that had spent over a thousand dollars a year on Beautylish. That was not me, so I was only able to get the smaller box, which was 82, including shipping. It was, I think, 75 plus seven dollars shipping. So let's go ahead and open up the lucky bag, but it's really a box, and let's show the inside. Wait, 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 wait. <gasps> this is really full. Okay, it's so. Pretty. Hopefully it's not full of a bunch of packaging. Oh, sorry, Lila, did I just bonk you? Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the way it looks on the inside. It is pretty, isn't it, Lila? Yep. Okay, let's see what this little tag says. It just says, Lucky Bags are a Japanese New Year tradition that inspired us to create our own. And then it tells you a little bit about the Lucky Bag. Uh, and you can sign up, I believe, for a notification for next year's Lucky Bag if you would like. All right. Go ahead, John. Mommy's nervous. Mommy's very nervous. Okay. We'll let the youngest go first. Okay, what is that? Okay. okay, let us unpack. Lila, do you want to unwrap it? Yeah. Okay, let's see what it is. I did see some people on my Facebook group unwrapping there, so I kind of know what could be in here, okay. but I don't know what it is. So we have two things. Ooh. Okay, you know what this is, I think. Oh, this is a bioderma. Yeah, Lila bioderma. did. <laughs> you did we my got makeup. That last year too. I did get it last year, you're absolutely right. So there's a small version of the bioderma. And I think this stuff goes bad uh, relatively quickly, and I still have my old one, so I should probably get rid of that one and just start using this one, so. And then what's the other one? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> what is it, what is it? So I'm excited to get the, the Bioderma again. What is that? Oh, it looks good. I don't what know. is it? I don't know, I'm too excited. I have to take it from you. <gasps> oh, it's a Smith & Colt nail polish. Ooh, I do like Smith & Colt. I don't think that they're worth the price point, but I do really like this. I wish that it was a different color. I've got a million burgundy kinds of shades, but I don't have a burgundy Smith & Colt, so I'm, I am excited to have this. I do like Smith & Colt as a nail polish brand. All right, now it's John's turn. No, it's Lila's turn to pick one out, and John gets to unwrap it. So John, go ahead and unwrap it. I feel like I've got a lot of stuff in here. I might have gotten a real lucky one because people get different ones. Yeah. You don't know... Um, I feel like there's more stuff in here. Like I might have gotten an actual lucky one, which I've never gotten before. They've always been kind of the typical ones. My stomach is like literally like, not literally, but my stomach has tickles in it. Like I've got butterflies in my stomach. Not literally though. Yay! This is a good one. Okay, Charlotte Tilbury. Yes, I don't own anything by Charlotte Tilbury. Can you believe that? Charlotte Tilbury, what is it? And Norman Parkinson. What is this? Oh, and then the Orbe, Orbe, Orbe. I saw pretty much everybody got this Orbe Wave and Shine Spray. Is that fun? What is this by Charlotte Tilbury? Oh my goodness. I'm like shaking because I'm so excited about this. Oh my gosh, yes! I don't own any of this. Look at that. It's a cream highlighter and bronzer. I've heard such good things. You want to smell it? Does it smell good? Yes. It actually does. It smells like very floral. It does. Very nice, so it's got a mirror and everything in it. I don't know which thing this is, I don't see it. Oh, Film Star Bronze and Glow. I've heard great things about this. This is great so far. All right, so now John gets to pick one. 
I really think I might have gotten like a better one, like a bigger one. And they just, they don't know that I'm a YouTuber. Like they don't know that I make beauty videos. It just kind of goes into the mess. And even if they did know, they don't, don't do anything special for people to make YouTube brush. videos. Okay, this is the brush. I did see this on someone else's. It just says powder on it. I don't know what brand it is. The other person didn't know what brand it was. So I will have to look that up. Isn't John supposed to be unwrapping? No. No. I picked it Oh, you up. picked it. Okay. I lost track. <laughs> I'm glad they remember. It's very, well, it's kind of soft. It doesn't feel particularly magical, but it doesn't feel bad. It feels soft. It feels nice. Now it's Lila's turn. What is that? That looks good. What is that? Lila, what is it? Mommy's so excited. It's like Christmas for Mommy. It what is it? I don't know. <sighs> it is the makeup. Atelier Paris Five Palette Ombres a Paupier. I'm sorry, I don't speak French. Paupiers. I'm gonna try. My grandmother would not be proud of me right now. She's French Canadian, or she was French Canadian. And it looks like an eyeshadow palette. Hold on a second, I have to open this first. Oh. So it's an eyeshadow palette, it's a neutral eyeshadow palette. I don't know this brand, but it's got a really nice range of colors in there. Very nice. Ooh, I love it. I love it. If I don't think I can use this, I'll probably pass it on to my mom because I think my mom would really, really like this. Okay, one more big thing. Okay, so, so far, is this worth $80? No, but I'm hoping that this is going to push it over the edge. Or is that just packaging? <gasps> That's just packaging. That's it. I did not get one of the huge, super lucky ones. Oh, big bummer. That's just packaging. Aww. Oh, I thought there was more in here. Oh, that's it? <laughs> wah, wah, wah. I thought that was there was more in here. Oh, I thought I got the lucky one. I was so excited. And then the big crash and burn. <sighs> okay, so let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about what just happened here. Because now everything just kind of went, oh. <laughs> Okay, $80, $80. Okay, this here is a beach spray. I don't really use beach spray. I don't want the wick, it makes my hair feel. This is gonna be passed on. Bioderma, I've tried before. So Bioderma, I, like Bioderma. I love. I love Bioderma. But this doesn't have a high dollar value either, but yeah. I do love this, mm -hmm. okay? The brush, I don't need, could live without. I like Smith & Colt as a brand, but I've got a million of this shade. So I'm kind of excited about this. Would I have purchased this? Absolutely not. I would have purchased a different shade from Smith & Cole, but I know that it's a more expensive thing. The eyeshadow palette, I'm gonna have to try it. I'm assuming this is a very high dollar amount. You guys know and I don't at this point because I've put dollar amounts down below. Uh, but can I say I'm super excited about it? Not right now, but I haven't tried it yet. The only thing I'm really, really excited about is the Charlotte Tilbury, um, was it the blush, what was it called? Something in Brighton, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> the oh, oh thank you for giving me hugs Johnny's trying to make me feel the, better the film star bronze and glow I'm very excited about this and this is really the only thing I'm very excited about this is not worth $82 to me so I am not excited about this <laughs> lucky bag I was excited and no I'm not I thought that whole thing was full of something I know I thought it was like three things in there. yeah one two three four five six six things so it was six things I wish there was seven. One exciting thing. So I am happy to have it. I probably wouldn't have purchased this. So it's kind of now given it to me because I wouldn't have purchased it at full price because it's kind of out of my price range. But then the $75, $82 thing apparently was in my price range because I'm a makeup addict and I'm a gambler. So, I mean, the Lucky Bag really is a gamble. I can't hate on people that I feel like got, you know, I really would have loved to have gotten a Viseart palette. I really would have loved to have gotten a Natasha Denona palette. Uh, I would have loved that more than I love this. But, you know, that's the risk you take. That's the risk you take. I got a positive attitude. I got some stuff to try, and I don't think I've got my $82 value, but I am happy that I did it. So I want to thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, definitely make sure that you hit the subscribe button. And make sure that you hit the thumbs up button because it makes me look super cool. And hit the bell if you want to be notified when I make a new video. Thank you so much for watching. And you want to stay with me, kids? Yes. All right, ready? Mad love, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye! All right. Okay, we're done. We're done. It's a mess in here. That's okay. Boom! Boom!